One week ago in Candia, a snowmobile was left in pieces and a 42-year-old man rushed to the hospital. It was very serious. Um, the person ended up um, passing away due to his injuries. The accident is still under investigation, but in the early stages, New Hampshire Fish and Game believes going too fast in dangerous conditions was the main fact. Speed is always the cause of most of all of our accidents. According to Fish and Game, in season, snowmobiling accidents happen every week, but ones that are deadly happen a handful of times a year in the Granite State. And with the nor'easter on the way, Lieutenant Cheney wants people to be extra cautious if they hit the trails. Our trails are in very poor conditions in the south, so all this snow is going to do, if we get a foot of snow, it's just going to put a blanket over all the obstacles and dangers that are underneath that. Um, there's no kind of snow base to protect you from hitting rocks and things like that. We're in Bow right now, right next to a snowmobiling trail, and this is exactly what Fishing Game is warning you about. I want you to take a look at my pants. I am wet from this part down. That's because we tried to get through these swampy conditions to the other side. And Fishing Game also told me that there was just a couple of days ago a snowmobile that got stuck in this area right here and had to get towed out. The trails sometimes, a lot of times in the woods, will go over swamps, which are generally frozen during the winter months, um, but they're not right now, so people are falling through. And Fishing Game's phone has been ringing off the hook with these kind of calls. The springtime and the early fall time of riding, that's the most dangerous time because we don't have a good base set up. In Bow, Troy Lynch, WMUR News 9.